Thanks for being here for WAND News at 6. Continuing coverage now from the courtroom. Two Springfield EMS workers fighting to maintain their innocence. All of this happening in a Sangamon County courtroom. Yes, that's right. Peggy Finley and Peter Cadigan pled not guilty now to killing 35-year-old Earl Moore Jr. Officials say they strapped him face down on a gurney. WAND's Carly Bronkema was in court. As Finley and Cadigan walked in, Carly, what did you learn today? Dawn, an Illinois State Police Sergeant took the stand today. He shared the role that Cadigan and Finley had in the death of 35-year-old Earl Moore Jr. Illinois State Police looked into the training for both of the Life Star ambulance workers. They say this was to determine if Cadigan and Finley knew it was medically dangerous to strap more face down. The sergeant told the court, Cadigan told investigators he had not received any training that, per that pertained to patient positions on a gurney. But investigators found Cadigan had completed that training twice. However, Cadigan and Finley's attorneys argued that there is not enough evidence presented to prove that the pair committed first degree murder. Now, both Cadigan and Finley are due back in court in February. We'll have more information on what happened in court proceedings today and a breakdown of that on our website, WANDTV.com. Live in Springfield, Carly Bronkma, WAND News. Well, just yesterday, Earl Moore Jr.'s family spoke out for the first time since his death. The family says they hope the lawsuit could prevent future tragedies. Our family will grieve Earl for the rest of our lives. And we hope by standing here today and by pursuing justice, we can help prevent any other family from experiencing this kind of horrible loss. WAD News has been following the story since it broke last week. You can see our full coverage at our website, WANDTV.com. Also, stay up to date with the latest breaking news. Download the WAND News app.